All right, thank you, Michael. Today, a major topic of a discussion at the Henry's Fork Watershed Council meeting was Idaho Fish and Game's proposal for a new boat ramp on the Teton River just west of Rexburg. Local News 8's Esme Carriega followed up on the issue. She was there at the public meeting. Esme, a lot of people there weren't there. Jay, it was a packed room full of people who wanted to voice their concerns. And at times, things got a little heated between opinions. It doesn't make sense to me. That's my concern. People openly expressed their thoughts on the idea of a boat ramp making its way into their neighborhood. It's been a floating issue for some time. Now, I heard some of the concerns that you had during the discussion. You seem a little outspoken about the subject and passionate. What exactly are the concerns? This is not a very good area of river to be floated by non-experienced floaters. She also says, and if a boat ramp is put in there, it's going to draw the public to an easy access point. More stranded victims on that stretch of river. Fishing Game Regional Fishery Manager Dan Guerin explains the next step. Address some of the issues that were brought forth today and bring back a, a proposal that is, is maybe better suited to the site uh, and to the concerns of the public. Now, the meeting concluded without an endorsement from the Henry Fork Watershed Council. Reporting live from the newsroom, I'm Esme Cariega. Okay. Thanks, Esme. The Idaho Department of Fish and Game currently maintains over 50 fishing and boating access sites across the region.